Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Hannah Jewell. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. The clock is ticking for the big three and the United Auto Workers Union to agree on a new contract and prevent a strike. A professor at Kettering University tells us meeting the UAW's demands, including 40% pay increases, cost of living adjustments and health benefits for retirees will mean increased product prices to meet overhead costs. UAW members have until August 24th to, vis to vote whether or not to authorize this strike. We'll keep you updated. Back to the Bricks is in full gear. People were partying like it was 1989 last night. The fun continues today. During the 80s themed cruise and concert, there was a lot going on. Back to the Bricks will wrap up today with the all day long car show and live music. The opening ceremony starts at 10 a.m. with a tribute to active military members. If you've been waiting for a Chick-fil-A to open in our area, you won't have to wait much longer. According to Chick-fil-A Inc., the location under construction in Flint Township on Miller Road is expected to open this fall. If you want to start a career with the company, they are looking to hire 120 part and full-time employees. You can apply in the hot link section on WNEM.com. Now here's Kyle Gillette with a look at your forecast. Thank you, Hannah. As we go throughout the rest of your day today, we're talking about really nice conditions out there for us. In fact, those temperatures are right around where they're supposed to be for this time of year. We're talking temperatures making it into the upper and uh, upper, upper 70s rather and lower 80s and lots of sunshine out there, lighter winds out of the south and southwest throughout the day. So as we go throughout the rest of the day today, those southwest winds, not much of a problem. But as we go into the overnight hours, the winds don't necessarily turn gusty. It's the direction that's a little bit more of an issue for us. And we'll feel that as we go into your Sunday temperatures overnight tonight only making it down into the lower 60s and for some folks that's going to be almost 20 degrees warmer than it was uh, this morning and what that means for us is we're bringing up a lot of warmth and moisture going into the beginning of your Sunday and we're really going to feel that as we go into the afternoon temperatures should make it into the upper 80s and lower 90s out there we will also have all that humidity so heat index values likely making it into the lower and middle 90s as we go into the afternoon we'll also have this very small chance as you can see at a few moments there uh, an isolated shower could try to pop up though most folks will be dry for your Sunday so again a mostly dry weekend here for us definitely dry for us today uh, just about 90% of mid Michigan will be dry for us tomorrow and then Monday looks dry as well Tuesday a small chance for a couple of late in the evening showers uh, but again mostly dry there Wednesday dry as well so a decent dry stretch and temperatures are a little bit all over the place here for us warming up quite a bit as we go to Sunday and then cooling right back down into the middle and upper 70s by Tuesday and looking ahead to Thursday and Friday, we are keeping an eye out on additional chances for rain and also a little bit more of the ups and downs with temperatures potentially making it back into the middle and upper 80s. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 7 for the latest news, weather and information.